but the attitude of the people. Yeah. Because you and I sitting here, no matter how much defeat our team is suffering, we'll never invade the pitch and go and beat us up, <laughs> beat up a, a, a our coach own coach. or an official. We will not do that. Why should you do that? Why should that be okay? And the people of uh, Sinyani or the people of in B, they're the most passionate people. They watch football a lot. They've contributed a lot to our football. And the people there from the Brunahafu region, a lot of them, in fact, majority of them are very sensible football fans. So those ones, you have to do some gatekeeping and take care of the ones that are spoiling the names of everybody. Because something else had been going on. Some rivalry between BA clubs and the Northern clubs. And every season, we record incidents. After you go to Doma and get beaten, they go to Insuache, get beaten, they go to Sunyani, get beaten. They go to, uh, then uh, so, uh, Doma goes to, Ejana uh, goes to Tamale. Incident happens. We have to stop these things. So the GFA has its role to play. But the people that watch the football, it's not life and death. Football, no. It is not life and death. So please, 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 all the people who invaded the pitch, did you see? Are you proud of the video? You that some of you even went onto that page. You had no business going there. And you're in, in fact, even when I can I guarantee you, when Bofakwa qualified to play in the Premier League, not even that many people invaded the pitch to celebrate. But we saw the video. Why should that many people invade the pitch just to create chaos? What are you doing on the pitch? You have no business on the pitch. Your game is ended. Go home. It was even a draw. You are not required to win every single game. You, it's not owed you. It's a football match. You understand? So, listen. The football fans, for me, I think that is where the biggest responsibility is. And that is why this country is not moving forward. One of the biggest problems with this country is the attitude of the citizens. Uh, be we now. Uh... Be we no. It's true. You want a clean city, and yet you drink pure water and throw it onto the street. How can the city be clean? How can the city, you, you, you throw it, uh, uh, last week, uh, two weeks ago, I saw a video on Twitter. The woman, she sells plantain. She peeled the plantain, uh, it was raining. Across the she, road. She, she carried the, 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 <laughs> the, the peels of the plantain, came to pour it inside the gutter. Why, why would you do this and expect the country to go forward? Our attitudes need to change. It needs to start with us. Because trust me, no matter what happened, if, any, if the fans did not invade the pitch, we didn't need the police. You don't need a thousand police officers there. If the fans didn't invade the pitch, what happened would not have happened. So li listen, let's start with ourselves, okay? We don't want to come here next week and come and discuss these things. Because B, look, I love B. I respect the people there. I respect their contribution to football. Don't spoil the names of everybody from, uh, from, 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 from B. A few hooligans. What is this? What is the meaning of this?